State police tell 2822 News the investigation into a shooting that took place during a child custody exchange last night is moving forward. And happened near Hazleton. Troopers say one man was wounded, the child and the mother were not hurt. But that shooting has now prompted law enforcement agencies to advise people to use safe zones in such custody exchanges. 2822 News I team reporter Andy Mahalshik has the latest from Wilkesbury tonight. Andy. Well, good evening, Nick and Candace. Police chiefs across the area tell me that by far the majority of child custody exchanges are carried off without any problems, no violence whatsoever, no such incidents like that. But they say emotions can still run high in many of those cases, and they advise all families to keep safety at the top as a top priority. And they say using police departments like Wilkesbury, having those exchanges take place there may be a good idea. I just think people that need to realize, you know, you're in a situation where you, you, your number one priority is obviously your children. A Luzerne County District Attorney Sam Sangladochi talking with the I-Team in the wake of a shooting Thursday afternoon near Hazleton. State troopers say Ruschietta Wilson was exchanging custody of her four-year-old daughter with Joseph Fabio Feliciano near the Turkey Hill on Route 924. A physical confrontation broke out. A single shot was fired from a 9mm pistol. Feliciani was shot in the leg. He was taken to a hospital with non-life-threatening injuries. The child and Wilson were not injured. DA Sangodochi says families in custody situations should use so-called safe zones. Especially if you're in a contentious situation. So not, not all of them involve a lot of arguing and fighting, but you generally will know uh, when you're in that type of situation. We recommend that those exchanges be made at a police department. In fact, some police departments, like the Kingston Township Police Department in the back mountain of Missouri County, have set up designated child custody exchange zones in front of their departments. While other departments, like Pittston, may not have a designated area, they still advise families to come to their police departments. Uh, they don't necessarily have to contact us. They can show up right in front of the city hall and, and do the child custody exchange. And we recommend if there's, if there's a problem with parents or guardians being civil. Marsha Piga is executive director of the Domestic Violence Service Center in Luzerne County. She says drama can play out even in the most amicable child custody cases. These can be some of the most emotionally traumatic experiences and even very dangerous, especially if there's a history of domestic violence. Typically, tensions escalate during custody exchanges if there's been a history of poor communication. And once again, law enforcement officials tell me that, again, by far the majority of child custody exchanges, while they may be very emotional, violence does not occur. Also, state troopers say at this point charges have not been filed in connection with that Hazel Township shooting with the child custody exchange yesterday. Back to you. All right, interesting. Andy, thank you. And